<laughs> Good morning. Welcome to Ozarks Fox AM on this Discovering Middle Names Day. I'm Jeremy Rabe. And I'm Madison Renee. Robert <laughs> Renee Conklin hyphen Puga the third. The third Esquire. Esquire. <laughs> what does that mean? I think it means you're a lawyer. Oh. <laughs> oh. ESQ? Yeah. I, had ne I never think. knew what that meant. I knew DDS. That's a dentist. Did you ever? Right? Oh, yeah, DDS. DDS? Yes. Uh, did you ever watch Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure? I did not. Because one of them always put Esquire at the end of their name. I can't remember which one. <laughs> I Bill love that. Well, hey, just call me a lawyer. Yeah, we were trying to guess people's middle names. So, uh, Madison, I always call her Madison Renee. Don't and I why. appreciate it. I love it. I'm just like, I feel like I need to give you your own middle name. Thank you. And if you were to give me a middle name, what would you give me? Mm, okay, Jeremy. So Jeremy Rabe. Um, I really like Jeremy Theodore. Oh, I like that. Rabe. And I go by Theo. Yes. Yes. Or and JT. Theo Rabe. Theo Rabe. JT. Or JT. Mm. Okay, I, I want to call out, okay, because tomorrow's his last day, and we're going to miss Coop so much. He's our camera op Coop. Okay. We'll give him a proper send up tomorrow. However, he informed us his name is Braden Cooper, and I can never remember Braden. I always called him Hayden because I have a nephew named Hayden. <laughs> and I was thinking Brendan. Sorry, See? Coop. <laughs> and then we're discovering middle names. And discover, do you mind if I tell your middle name? Nope. His middle name is Greg. Not, not Gregory. Not Gregory, just Greg. Greg. There's Brayden Greg <laughs> Brayden <Cooper>. Greg. <laughs> now, I'm sure his parents are watching, and he's probably going to get a text from his mom soon being like, why are they talking about your middle name? We want to know. Why? Why Greg and not Gregory? You know, where was the, you know, was it like everyone has Gregory as a middle name? Yeah. And we just want to go, Greg. Because to me, I mean, Brayden Gregory Cooper. That, yes. Sounds like a lawyer. Or. Nothing wrong with the Or name. because he's going to be a filmmaker. This film was brought to you by Brayden Gregory Cooper. Yeah, there you go. I'm just saying. But again, yeah. I always wished my name was Jeremiah and not Jeremy. Oh, I never knew that about you. Yeah, I always, it was gonna be Jeremiah up until the last minute and then my dad put a... The kibosh on it. He's like, no. Yeah. It was gonna be Toby. Like this was all like after I was born. Mm -hmm. Toby. Right, and that was the dog. Then my dad came in and said, nope, it was my dog's name. And my grandpa goes, how about Jeremiah? And my dad's like, you're not naming my son. That's right, yep. And then it was Jeremy. I always got a kick out of my dad's middle name. It starts with an E. Okay, let me guess. So. Evelyn. No. Evelyn. Gregory Evelyn. Ev Gregory <laughs> Evelyn. Everett. Everett? No. Ev uh, Evan. Close. Evanator. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's Craig <laughs> Ernest Conklin. And I thought that was the funniest middle name as a kid. Ernest? Like, Craig Ernest. <laughs> I don't know. I will why. tell you, okay. Oh, so silly. I learned, loved the Ernest movies, like Ernest Goes to Camp. Yeah. Ernest Goes to Jail. Uh -huh. My brother Jason. <laughs> that one too, yeah. <laughs> Craig, Ernest my, Goes to Jail. Ernest Craigenator, <laughs> Ernest Evernator. Uh, my brother Jason, he, I, God love him. And he was my grandpa. My grandpa who passed years ago, his name was Francis. And they called him Fran. Okay. So my, J, my brother's middle name is Francis, Jason Francis Rabe. But he always hated that growing up. Well, because I associate Francis with a female name, yeah. but there are many males many named males Francis. Francis. Yeah. yeah. Look at this. We're diving deep. You guys know more about us. You want my social? Here it is. No. <laughs> <laughs> also, <laughs> quickly, too, if you guys want to see a behind-the-scenes video that director Kira took of us yesterday, we posted that on our social, and I cannot stop laughing at it. Maddie made me laugh so hard, so there you go. That's your Now tease. we'll bring in uh, Jesse... Ed, go Rob, ahead. No, Jesse Robert Robertson Jesse. Inman. There we go. Robertson. And oh. Angela Marie Christine. Lisa Christina Aguilera Luna. <laughs> there we there go. go. There it is. Uh, the I Aguilera. am Hispanic, so we have like five different names. There you go. Actually. It makes oh, sense. That oh, works. It, adds just, up. <laughs> <laughs> it is just Angela Christine, though. Yeah. I, I like know. Christine Aguilera. Yeah. I know. I'll have to add we that just in there. Angela, Angela Christine Aguilera. Yeah. yeah, yeah there we go. We have to Delina, say it though. with like this. Oh, that's yes. the Britney Spears. Uh, that's that's yeah. Britney Spears. <laughs> no, Christine Aguilera <laughs> would be like. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I love it. What are we we lost it. Yes. Yes. I yes. love it. Okay. Oh, man. A quick little like story, though, about like my middle name, though. So I tore my hamstring a couple times being a dancer. Okay, Ironically, my about. initials are ACL. Oh, <laughs> there you go. Like, oh, what wow. Is this? All comes together. So I was like, wow. But isn't your ACL yeah. in your knee? Uh, yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. But, but it's the still tear. An oh, so I got it. I got it. Sorry, I was wanting to make yeah. sure I knew what I was. Okay. Thinking. Your initials were like H A M. 
Like ham. throw your hamstring. Ah, it's where my ham. Oh, ham string. Funny. Oh, I thought your story was gonna be about ham, and it got real no. excited. No. no, ham and beans. No, ham and I was. Being kosher. I was this close. <laughs> yes, she got it. She got it. <laughs> yes, I just want to say I was this close to being named Clifford. So. I could see that. That's Crisis. my grandpa's name. Mine as well. Yeah. Okay, there you go. Yeah. I like the name Clifford. Yeah. Me the yeah. Gold. That'd be something else if yeah, I was named Clifford. Crisis averted. All right. <laughs> Uh, let's take a little uh, moment to share some emoji stories okay, with you please. here, okay? So, uh, if someone sends you a funny text message, how you respond might give away your age. That's what oh. they're saying. That's oh. what the people are saying. Oh, no. You might use the laugh so you cry emoji, the one top middle there. Mm -hmm. That one? Yeah. That's, that's me. Uh, that's the one I use. I love it. It's one of the big four, as they say. The others are rolling on the floor, smiley, the loud crying face, and finally, the skull, as you see here. Now. If you're a millennial, Gen X, or older, your response is like mine is, the laugh to you cry emoji. But the skull, as you see, that's for the younger kiddos. Oh. They're using the skull as if to say, oh, oh, oh I'm dead. Um, so that's how they would. <laughs> that's how they say it. That's how, oh, oh, man, I'm dead. So <laughs> if you use that, you're younger. And if you Jesse. use the top middle one there, you're old like me. So. Can I just say, yeah. it's so ironic you're doing the story. I got sent. The skull this week. Really? Really? And? And I replied, Are what the heck does that mean? You didn't know that? <laughs> Are you in danger? Ah. Oh, so no. I'm obviously old, and my sister in law, Whitney, uh. I had sent her something, yeah. like a uh -huh. picture, and she sent me back that skull. And I went, what does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> She's young and hip witted. I guess so. Halloween. I was so, now so it makes. funny. You mm -hmm. slammed the couch. I'm mm -hmm. just. Now I feel old and I'm upset about it. I know. Well, I'm going to say you. a lot about us. Yeah. yeah I'm well, now I'm going to send it out all the time now. <laughs> See, I've yeah. always used the school. I didn't. I didn't like think that was like. Uh, I don't know. When it's not even warranted, Jeremy's yeah. going to send a skull. Yes. Like, hey, where do you want to like, go for lunch? I'm skull. dead. Skull. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm dead. I always like to say like I'm weak, all caps, and then a bunch of skulls, and then like <laughs> the turning laughing emoji. Yeah. Oh, like the. Oh, yeah, but, on the oh, side. side. Yeah, I do yeah, like but the it's side. sideways. So I think that's the, is that the yes. rolling on the floor one? Maybe it is. Yeah. Maybe that's the one. Can we do a whole segment next week about emojis? emojis and telling us what they are? We should, because they always come out with new ones when they update the phone. I feel like Angela Christina Aguilera Luna would know. Oh, for sure. <laughs> well, gee, yeah, I'm you're a pro with at these. Yeah. I'm, a, I'm a pro <laughs> with the emojis. <laughs> well, our next center, our next store, not our next intersection. <laughs> but we're at a crossroads. We're at a so, <laughs> Yes. <laughs> If there's a story in Tennessee, an intersection there is getting a lot of attention. Folks in the town of Clarksville are calling her Rhonda the Roundabout. Oh. Some extended observation captured a few drivers getting caught in the loop, circling the roundabout 50 or more times what? before they figured out how to get off. I, I, oh, uh, my I word. have many questions for those folks. <laughs> Rhonda has been open less than a week, and already she has her own Facebook page with thousands of fans. Oh, my god. Rhonda. Goodness. Oh, okay, Rhonda. question. Yeah. yeah. Roundabouts, useful or do they congest things more? Okay, I actually like them. Okay. At first I was not a fan, but I like them a lot better now. Okay. Mm -hmm. I like mm -hmm. them better than stoplights because you don't have to wait as mm -hmm. long. Yes. Usually. True. I could, I see, the case. I could yeah. see the case for one. Here's one for you. How about the diverging diamond? I do not like I'm not that. a fan. Nope. What does that look like? That's what we oh, have. Oh, I have a Battle panic attack 65. every time. When you go to the other oh. side, that's called the Virgin Diamond. Oh, those ones yeah. trip me yeah. up. They're that fun. was Yeah, that was confusing when I first met I've seen My people driving backwards on the Virgin Diamond. Ah. And I've seen people driving backwards on the roundabout. Stop. Over there yes. at, at uh, you know, the one at um, Glenstone and James River Freeway? Yes. You know, over there by the Farmer's Park, the one yeah. they've added? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I saw a car yeah. driving backwards on that. No, nope. I always. I, I they went, Mr. never never get behind yeah. a vehicle ever no, again. If I'm, that was I'm you. notorious. I am notorious for on that specific uh, roundabout. I always turn too early, oh. and I end up going on James River East. <laughs> and I'm trying to go on Republic Road. Yes, I'm like, oh no, it's like I'm going to Sedalia. Don't go the far right <laughs> lane. Be in the yeah. Yeah. yeah tight yeah. inner lane. Tom, what do you prefer, diverging diamond roundabout or the stop sign? I would say a roundabout. They're yeah, they're going on me too. Oh, yeah. and the other thing is they build them because they're a little safer, you know. I agree. Because you're, when you if you hit someone, you're getting hit at an angle versus a T-bone. Oh, oh. Mm. there so we That's go. why they prefer it. They hit on a Some more. Some people fly into those yields. I've heard too with the I diverging know, like, diamond, it's to supposed to slow down going through intersections because you have to slow down to go uh, curve and curve instead of uh, driving straight through the intersection to try to make yeah, a light or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Could I, I don't really know. slow in that too. There's some oddities out there. I'll never forget. This was at a 
the roundabouts are everywhere yeah, in Kansas. Yeah, all over the world. Okay, as you know, Jeremy in Kansas, they're all over the place. Yeah. Um, one time around about in Kansas, I was driving behind this person. They turned, yeah, like you were saying, left. Yeah. They went the wrong yeah. way into the roundabout. And I'm like, what? Wow. How do you not know by now? Oh, I mean, my gosh. Excuse <clears throat> me. We don't drive on the left side of the road. Why would you? I know. It's like, well, why would you do that? Yeah. Oh, no. gosh. The friends we made. I, a whole bunch way. of confusing things. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Is it a windows down kind of day, though, Tom? <gasps> no. Oh, dang. Yeah, <laughs> come on. <laughs>